Hey everyone, this is Split Can Gamer. Welcome back to Let's Play No More Heroes. In the last part, we did a couple of side missions, side jobs, and we managed to I managed to buy a bunch of customizations and got enough money to fight the fourth ranked assassin. Where we ended up playing an interesting mini game of bullet time. So now and. And so now, during this time, we're now going to fight the fourth-ranked assassin, Harvey Moisewicz Volodarsky. And of course, it's going to be the magic show with Sylvia, too, so this should be interesting. You are late, Anselm. Hurry, the show's about to start. What's with all the excitement? It is not every day you get to watch a big fight from VIP seats. Of course I am excited, but I am most excited being with you. Whoa, you serious? I wouldn't do that if I were you. Oh shit, oh shit. I'm packing heat, baby. Ah, uh, horny Travis. and all killers out there. Welcome to Harvey Dolodarski's magic freak show of the century. It will be a killer night. So let's get started. It's showtime! Member. Aside from us. This is your lucky night. Me? They want me? Serious? You gotta be kidding. Go get them, Tiger. Come on, no need to be shy. Congratulations, you nasty little boy. Tell the audience your name. Travis Touchdown. It's a good name, don't you think? It's a fine name indeed. You have your parents to thank for that. My parents are dead. Oops! Touchy subject. A question that should not be touched upon. That's okay. Really, it is. Dear, dear, don't let it bother you. Hold on to your hopes and don't give up, my nasty little boy. <laughs> Thanks. I'll remember that. So you came to enjoy the show? Damn right I did. I was really looking forward to this. It's the last show, right? Last show? Did I hear you right? Oh, you heard me right. Harvey, you're gonna die tonight. Right here, by my hand. Let's close the curtains. I hope you aren't being serious. That would be a pity. We still have the main event to unveil. Playtime is over. Ladies and gentlemen, it's your time! To what audience? Also, you did say earlier, Harvey, that it was the last program, so you're kind of right there. On to the grand finale! Now this is entertainment! <laughs> it's killing time! Alright, so as you can see, Harvey basically uses his magic tricks to kill people. This assistance notwithstanding. Alright, so as you can see, Harvey basically uses doves to attack and uses, I guess, twin swords, basically as his choice of weapon. Okay. He teleports around the room and basically uses this is twin swords to basically form all kinds of illusions and spin attacks. I really also like the fight, the music in this fight. It's called Vecaliosis. I 
think that's what it's called. I don't know how it's pronounced. So as you can tell, Harvey definitely lives up to his name as as a as a magic assassin. As he basically uses his map magic to teleport all around the room. One thing I will say about this fight is that it is kind of a bit on the easy side. Especially from the fourth ranked assassin, I was kind of expecting more of a challenge. Like I said, I really enjoy the boss costume here because it really gives off that magic vibe. Also, another thing I gotta say about the cutscene prior is, like I said, aside from Sylvia, what other crowd are we performing to? That, and on top of that, that, and on top of that, we really get a little bit inside of Travis, because as we see that he does live on his own, but up until this point, we didn't know that his parents were dead. Oh yeah, I forgot Harvey does that, where on some occasions he'll literally flip the screen, but the fight will still remain the same. So as you can tell, this fight is a bit more of an assassination than a magic show. Check it out! Oh, okay, so in the back of the day. Like I said, the, con the controls remain the same, even with the screen upside down, so... So this... So this fight is definitely creative. Oh yeah, forgot to mention, there are some instances where Harvey will disappear and he'll try to trap Travis in the box for one hit KO. So I will have to stand up for this because after the fight with Holly, I don't really trust me sitting down with the... With the... Okay, so which one is it? Just tell me I did it right. Oh, thank God, good. So yeah, it's that's basically a one-hit KO, but if you basically do the motions correctly, it's pretty easy to get out of. Begin. 
So yeah, so so as Harvey loses health, he'll use that move a lot more frequently. Okay, which one is it? Please, for the love of God, I hate using the nunchuck on motion controls. Yes, thank you. So yeah, overall, the fight itself with Harvey is is pretty easy for the most part once you figure out the pattern. After you see me suck for most of this fight, but once you figure out the but once you figure out his pattern, Harvey is pretty easy. But it's a very creative fight. And we managed to beat Harvey just when the screen turns right side up again. And we get a pretty hilarious death scene. It's dark! Is somebody turn on the lights! I can't see shit! Oh, how am I supposed to perform in total darkness? Hit the lights! Hurry up! I can't see! It's dark! I'm surrounded by darkness! So yeah, Harvey just got killed by his own assistants and by his own magic tricks. That is gruesome yet hilarious at the same time. So yeah, overall the Harvey fight was really enjoyable. Like I said, it may be a bit on the easy side, but it's easily one of the most creative bosses in the game. And I loved it. The name is Travis Touchdown. Thank you all for coming tonight. I hope you enjoyed the show. I would also like to thank you for coming this evening. As a result, Travis Touchdown is now ranked fourth place. And the show will go on. I hope to see you all again soon. And have a good night. To what crowd of people? This whole time the crowd's been empty. Where are they clapping? You can clearly see there are no people in the audience! Oh, and we get to see Travis making out with Sylvia as we see only Harvey's mask left. Yeah, like I said, we were basically performing to a crowd of people that, was, that didn't have a crowd. Alright. Alright, so Harvey Moisewitz Volodarsky is dead, and Travis is now ranked fourth. Ugh, oh, that was such a fun fight. Saving and we're now ranked fourth. Hi, this is Diane from BTED Videos. We're calling to let you know that the video you returned was a copy of one of our video titles. Um, the best of raunchy amateur interviews too. You didn't seem to copy the whole tape though. You ended two minutes into the middle of the first interview. Anyway, please be sure to return the original tape you borrowed. Thank you. Good morning, Mr. Touchdown. Are you on the throne again? Please wire us the money now. Well, not even a congratulations for getting ranked fourth. Okay, let's see. 450,000. Whoopee. All right. Um, alright, alright, let's just go to the fridge real quick, 
Uh, okay, am I crazy or did we not get any more health? In fact, now that I think about it, we didn't get... Hey! Lookity kitty. He's so, yeah. so pretty and sweet. Why is Jane so adorable? Alright. How many cards did I get since the last time we just... Oh wow, I... I'm such an idiot. I, I missed a lot of cards in the past boss fights. But like I said, save final on SD cards, so we're good. Alright, so let's see, anything new? Okay, just new part-time job. Okay, so Okay, so there was one like right here the whole time. Well, I've never been behind the motel, so let's Well, that's definitely one way to get around. Yeah, I just realized we didn't get any sort of health upgrades. All right. So Okay, so I guess you just gotta hold the boost long enough and we're... Of course, let's park right in the middle of the road. So let's go to Beefhead videos and see if there are any new videos Bishop has for us. Alright, so let's see... Okay, so it looks like it's just those three. Come back again. Well, that's kind of disappointing, really, because it seems like once you get everything, there's really no need to come back to this place, so that's kind of a disappointment. Alright. So, yeah. Yeah, so I just now noticed that we didn't get any health upgrades after killing Harvey like we did with the other bosses. Well, minus let's shake, of course, but that's beside the point. So, let's, see. let's stop by Thunder Reuse and see if if I can do anything to get more health. Okay, let's see. I know you want that, right? All right. Let's go to training. Let's see if there's. No, nope, it doesn't look like it. Alright. Oh yeah, and as it's further and further the ranks you go up, the training gets more expensive. do is that you gotta I'll hold you gotta press the re a button with your right finger while holding the Wii remote with your left hand. That's really the only trick I can think of to get through these kind of kind of button mashing training sessions. Alright now I gotta stand up for this. like there wasn't any training to increase your health so I don't know if that's a good that's I'm not sure if that's a good sign or not because usually you have to get the health power-ups and some more money when you beat the boss so I'm not sure why I'm not 
so I'm not sure what it is why I didn't get any now. But let's see. So let's go check out the side job and see what's new. We're about three minutes in out of my way. Um, actually, let's stop by Area 51 to see if we can... Alright, so let's see, so anything new? Sunglasses are the same, but I'm not really a fan of any of them. Alright, let's take a look at the jackets. Oh, that one is so cool! You know what? Screw it. We're getting it. Alright. What about the t-shirts? Let's see what we got. Alright. I like this one. Um... Cat fight. Let's get that one too. Alright. So jeans. I'm really just not a fan of any of these like ripped jeans. Plus the one that I currently have fits it's the current style that I'm going with. And the same thing with the belts. Alright. Take care now, brother. Alright. And you know, I think that's gonna do it for this part. Uh, so in the next part, we're gonna travel to see this new side mission. So I'll see you guys in the next part. Bye.